I used to run a very large uh, research and development operation in Wellcome years ago. And in those days, and by many other pharmaceutical companies' standards, we felt that we could do all of this work in-house. Well, the complexity of today's discovery and development programs have shown you simply can't do that. TI Pharma has a proven track record in bringing different kinds of expertise, whether that's academia, knowledge institutes, research institutes generally, big pharmaceutical companies, small startups, SMEs, and using all their skills to bring that to a conclusion, to not just do interesting academic research, but to deliver the products that come from that kind of collaboration. An important factor in the uh, challenges we have for drug discovery and development is predictability. How do we know that an entirely new chemical or piece of biological material is going to be safe in a human being or is actually going to work in the particular disease condition? There's a project on African sleeping sickness, which is a desperate condition, and they're really looking at new ways of attacking that disease using existing medicines which we know are safe but work in a different condition. And more recently, some work on a disease called schistosomiasis. It's a little snail-borne disease in the waters, and it can really attack the organs of the body. So no one company is likely to be able to deal with a condition like that, nor is there any profit in it for them to do so. One of the big killer diseases, of course, is cancer. Now, that's not just one disease, it's a whole array of different conditions. And one of the things that TI Pharma have done very successfully in recent years is to try and find entirely new ways of arresting the tumour growth in a particular cancer. But far from just seeing whether that's interesting science, they've moved it into the clinic, a company's been formed that's going to take it into the marketplace to the benefit of patients. So there's an example of translational science organised and managed effectively by TI Pharma. With the incredible increase in our understanding of disease, and yet our still lack of understanding of some of the basic mechanisms, it's going to be even more important going forward to bring partners together. And TI Pharma can be and should be at the centre of that kind of activity. Because what you can deliver from that is much more efficient healthcare provision, much more cost-effective healthcare provision, faster time to market, and quicker patient benefit. And all the skills which TI Pharma have gathered over the years really can be important in that delivery. Music